the build quality of this guitar is on another level. Hi everyone, Julian here. Welcome to the weekly guitar meeting at Zika's Guitars. I hope you are fine and healthy and thanks for tuning in. Today we have six very special guitars. Six guitars which have been showcased at the Roma Expo guitar exhibition in Italy, in Roma. And these guitars are built specially or exclusively for the Roma Expo guitars exhibition and they are truly fantastic so we have some of these guitars every year at Zika's Guitars and I personally I'm always very excited and happy to see these guitars to play on them and to show you to show them to you and let's start with the first guitar the first guitar of this week is made by Fabio Tontini from Italy of course because all the guitars which are at the Roma Expo guitar exhibition are made by Italian guitar luthiers and this guitar is the REG so Roma Expo guitar edition and fantastic looking guitar with a great brilliant um, rosette work which is a little bit inspired by Torres guitars so the whole shape of this guitar is, is in, inspired by Torres guitar. So it's a Torres based model, I would say. We have a spruce top and Caribbean rosewood back and sides. Let's see how it sounds. I will play more and then I will say a few things. So the first thing what I personally notice is the very fast response of this guitar. It's a very responsive guitar and you have also... I think the basses of this guitar are somehow very punchy, very well resonating. So if I play the basses I can feel the whole vibration in my body, through my body and it's also typical for Taurus based model guitars. And it has a very direct sound so you can hear everything very clean, clear and very fast somehow. This is how I would describe the sound of this guitar.
love the mid range of this guitar. It's something what you sometimes miss in other guitars. Let me know what do you think about the sound of this guitar. I think it was a little bit out of tune at the end. Since the strings are very new on each guitar, it may be out of tune while I'm playing. But it's a great sounding guitar, very responsive. And the mid-range of this guitar is very present and uh, it looks also very beautiful. And it's very light. So congrats to Fabio Sondini for this great instrument and let's move to the next Italian beauty. This guitar is made by Francesco De Gregorio from Italy of course and this is also a brand new guitar from 2023 and this is the Roma Expo guitar edition so REG model and this guitar oh look at it this is beautiful this guitar has a spruce top and Indian rosewood back and sides. So a very classic uh, construction or let's say choice of wood. It has a 7 fan bracing and it has the number 99. Let's play some notes on it. What a beautiful tone. Very charming sound and a very wide palette of different colors. Even if you don't your move even if you don't move your fingers a lot. And it has a good sustain. Das? 
Das spielt ihr seit zwei Wochen eigentlich. Echt? Ja. Warum hast du es geändert? Habt sich geändert, das habe ich hinzugefügt. Damit die Leute so ein bisschen erfrischender. curious about your opinion. Let's move to the next guitar. For me personally, this guitar is one of the highlights of the Roma Expo guitars in this year. And this guitar is made by Angelo Vailati. This guitar has a spruce top and Indian rosewood back and sides. The build quality of this guitar is on another level. It looks so beautiful and there are so many very well worked details and beautiful aesthetical ideas on this guitar that I am um, blown away by this guitar. This guitar is of course brand new from 2023 and this is also a Roma Expo guitar edition. I won't talk a lot, I will just start to play on this guitar and you can judge the sound. great sustain first of all very even very clean and very well balanced this is the first thing and the tone the quality of the tone is exceptional just enjoy it Thank you. 
somehow everything works very well on this guitar. I also feel very comfortable during playing and somehow I don't make any mistakes. Usually I make a lot of mistakes, but in this case... joy to play on this guitar this is an absolutely stunning guitar and let's move to the next guitar of this week this beautiful guitar is made by Lucio Antonio Carbone what, what do you think with the, with the walnut is very interesting you know? because it's not it's, the first, it's the first guitar I do to do this and how do you find it what do you think I, I bought uh, at other five sets <laughs> really <laughs> yeah. so you're really enjoying what yeah, you're yeah, with, yeah, with, yeah. Uh, absolutely I mean, what what you're trying to achieve with Walnut? This kind of sweetness in the in the travels. Mm -hmm. yeah. You said as well that Torres used Walnut. Uh, yes, a couple of times. Yes. Mm -hmm. Sure. And this is also a Roma Expo guitar edition, and this guitar is called La Italica. A lot of Italian guitar luthiers and big names like. Um, Galinotti, they started to build guitars with Spanish construction in the 20th century. It wasn't only the construction of guitar, which was Spanish. They tried to add some elements of Italian art, Italian traditional art. And Lucio Carbone was also inspired by that idea and has built this beautiful guitar. And this guitar has a spruce top and Italian walnut back and sides. Very light, very charming looking guitar and I am very curious about the sound. has a very well balanced sustain and a very bright tone. sure if it's a bright tone I would say it's a clear tone a very noticeable tone but it's covered with some smoothness yeah I would def definitely say it in this way because it's not bright it's just clear so the tones 
separation is great. of this guitar are just it's very deep I think it has a very deep main resonance wow Fantastic instrument by Lucio Antonio Carbone. Let me also know your opinion, how you hear the sound of this guitar. I'm very curious about it. And let's move to the last guitar of this week. And the last guitar of this week is made by Fabio Schmidt. Fabio, yes. tell me something about your special edition for this year Roma Expo okay. guitar. Okay, well, uh, they ask, I mean, the. Massimo Gabriele asked us to do something better, something special. But uh, how can I do? I should do the best every time. <laughs> and uh, in fact, is what I do. And so uh, that's why the project is uh, the same project I, I'm, I used since 2014. And, uh, but if you see the, the guitar in the decoration, and uh, in, in the, all the work for um, on the on the rosette, on the on the portfolio, on the on the headstock plate, uh, you can understand why we call uh, we can call it uh, a limited edition. Absolutely fantastic looking guitar. I really love the aesthetically ideas of this guitar or guitar luthier and. Uh, it's just beautiful. We have a spruce top and Indian rosewood back and sides. You can see a lot of challenging work on this guitar, but beautiful decoration. And uh, I would start to play on it and let's see how it sounds. This is 
a very well resonating guitar and it has a very airy sound, very full bodied sound. I'm impressed. Wow. So from my side, it sounds like a very powerful guitar. Uh, I have to hear the recording uh, after I'm finished uh, with the guitars. But uh, I think also from the other side, it's, it's a very loud and powerful guitar. And a very round sound. Very pleasing to the ears. This is a fantastic sounding guitar in terms of loudness, airy sound, full bodied sound, and also very well balanced. I like it really. So congrats to Fabio Schmidt for this great instrument. And this was also the last guitar of this week. I hope you enjoyed this week's weekly guitar meeting with this absolutely nice, not only good sounding guitar but also good looking so the italian guitar luthiers they pay a lot of attention to details and uh, decoration of guitars which is also important in my opinion and uh, yeah let me know what do you think about the sound of these guitars and which did you like the most thanks for tuning in have a good weekend and see you next week